This is Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I am here to do a reading for Aries. This is for Aries, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and this is for November, and any time in November, okay? So keep, <laughs> so keep in mind that not every reading is for you, okay? This reading may or may not be for you. We just had a mess. This was a mess, whatever. We got three cards. We do, we do, we do. Aries, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. Any time in November. Now keep in mind this reading may or may not be for you. Okay. Bird perch, waiting for news, package, or letter. Right now the bird is perched, so you may be still waiting for it. Ladder, climbing the ladder to success. So you're going to be climbing a ladder. Eagle, eagle. Triumph over troubles or obstacles. So there's going to be victory here over some sort of obstacle. So, but that's you needing to soar, needing to fly. You might need to fly. Maybe it's time to fly. Climbing towards success. We have bird twice. What do birds do? Birds fly. So it's time to fly. It's time for me to fly. I could sing, but not going to, not right now. Anyhow, um, although the words are coming. Anyhow, we're done. Uh, and what do we got, what do we got, what do we got for Aries? What do we got for Aries? Aquarius, something to do with wish fulfillment, okay? Something about your dreams, pay attention to your dreams. Oh, we had a jumper. Ooh, we did have a jumper now, didn't we? Act now, think later. It's time to go after your wish fulfillment. It's time to go after your dreams. Oh my God, I gotta show you what's on the bottom. Pay attention to your dreams. Pay attention to your dreams, Aries. It's time to climb that ladder to success, don't you think? You want to be at the bottom or you want to be at the top? That is the question. It feels like you're waiting. You're waiting for what? It's time to fly. It's time to fly. What do we have for Aries? Fool, leap of faith. That's your card. That's where that's rep Aries. That's represented by Aries. Leap of faith. This is take a risk. Just do it. Leap of faith. Archangel Metatron. Believe in yourself. Listen to your heart. Do what gives you joy. This is the fool card. This is a new beginning. It's a new journey. You need to take a risk. It's time. It's it's time for you to take a risk. Okay, you need to take a risk. Have faith, step forward in faith. It's time to step into unknown territory. Do something, do it. Follow your dreams, just do it. And that is leaving everything behind. Starting over from scratch. You have a new beginning here. You have, this is a new beginning. Act now, think later. Act now, think later. Just do it, just do it, just do it. But you don't have any faith? You need to replace your fear with faith, Aries. Tower reversed, first card out. That's a permanent loss. It's a permanent change. You never saw it coming, it's a painful change. This is moving. Maybe it's moving. You never saw it coming. It's this because it's, it's this something is happening that is very, very extreme. So whatever it is, we have a painful change here. It's unavoidable. It's been avoidable up until now. Eight of wands reversed. It could be extremely sudden, extremely fast. Oh, we got somebody here that's feeling guilty. They're feeling guilty. 
there's been a delay there has been a delay but it's unavoidable now things are something's gonna happen extremely fast the empress that's the basis of the situation the basis of the situation is the empress so uh, you must be dealing with an empress this is the goddess right this is the this is like aphrodite this is the goddess of love um unconditional love very abundant uh this is abundance this is an opportunity for abundance an unconditional love being loved and cared for and taken care of I mean, the Empress, she's a hostess. She has plenty. She can grow anything. She does grow anything. Devil in the past. So you got the devil in the past. Could be a Capricorn. Could be dealing with a Taurus or a Libra. Um, I feel like you're feeling some sort of disruption. You're feeling some sort of big, huge internal disruption right now. There's guilt, feeling guilty. Um, there's going to be an extreme... Uh, event that comes up very soon the devil behind you that's toxic codependent uh unhealthy behavior lust greed materialism that's in your past codependent tied to a situation you've been tied to a codependent situation for all the wrong reasons maybe it's lust maybe it's greed maybe it's codependency you've been there that's where you've been there. Some of you are learning your value. You're learning your value. The basis of the situation is the Empress. That is about love, unconditional love, right? That's the basis of this reading. Above you is the moon reversed, so, ha, huh. wow, wow, you could be dealing with the Pisces in reverse. This is a delusion, okay, this is a reality check, truths being revealed, something that has been hidden, all is not as it seems, what you see is not what you get, something has been hidden, there's been, and there is, there's still something that is hidden. Fear, there's been some sort of fear and guilt, feeling guilty, hiding something. There's some sort of illusion here. Somebody's hiding something. There's going to be a reality check. This is a, like revealing the truth. Truth's being revealed. Coming out of illusion. Death. Well, son of a gun. We got mostly majors. So we got, we got, uh, we got six cards and five of them are majors. So this is universally driven. The universe is driving a change and the tower is a universe card. So this is forced change. The universe is forcing you. They're going to cause major disruption. Okay. They're probably causing some internal disruption to force you to end something. Death is in your future. That's your future position. The near future is an ending that leads to a new beginning. Okay, this is a major transition, a major um, transformation. This is a separation or a loss. It's a profound change. Okay, this is an ending, okay, with a new beginning to follow. So that's what's coming. You do have something that is coming to an end. There's been lies. There's been deception. There's codependency here for sure. We have the devil and the moon, okay? The, both of those cards are ruled by the shadow. So there's a lot of darkness. What you see is not what you get, okay? There's been a lot of secrets. There's been a lot of lies. There's been a lot of deception. There's been a lot of fear. There's been a lot of things that have been hidden but this is coming out of the darkness it is coming you something is happening okay something big is happening this the 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 empress gives birth to a new life okay she gives birth she's the mother 
So we have a birth here. We do have a birth here. She, she, she gives birth to a new life, okay? She does. She nurtures things. She grows things. She loves things to their fullest potential. So there is, a, there, is, there, is a, there is a new life here that is about to begin. Death, the ending, an ending that leads to a new beginning. You are going to be experiencing a major, with all these major cards, a major rebirth or a major ending, a major, I feel like it's a loss. but it leads to a beautiful new life. This is a blessing. Okay, this is a miracle. This is a blessing. And it's, it's like it's what you asked for. And you gotta remember, we have the fool. So this is, this is a new beginning. It's, it, this is a brand new life. It's a new journey, starting a new journey. Starting a, you're gonna be starting a new life. You are. Hangman reversed, page of pentacles, king of swords, strength reversed. Whew. That's your overall outcome. I'm going to move this. I don't know. Your overall outcome is a strength reversed. Can't refrain yourself. Can't, there's no restraint. Making a decision, making a decision, being logical. There's going to, I feel like you are going to need to be logical. You're going to, there's some information that is coming. There's challenging information. There's going to be a challenging conversation. Somebody may even be judged. Page of Pentacles, your outside influence. There's somebody around you that is giving you a golden opportunity. This could be a new project, a new, a new uh, enterprise. That's your outside influence, the Page of Pentacles. That's, a, that's an opportunity for success that can lead to abundance. Somebody could be a Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, Page of Pentacles. This is somebody that has something for you that can lead you down the path to stability, to security, to abundance. This is like... A new opportunity it will take hard work. It may have to do, maybe it may require commitment. Page of Pentacles is about commitment. So, you know, I feel like you are given an opportunity to commit to something new. This could be a new job, a new project, a new enterprise, whatever. You're being given an opportunity, but you have to let go. Believe, no, belief. <laughs> Beneath that is the hangman reversed. So, that means you need to let go of something that you're hanging on to, a belief or something that you've been sacrificing yourself for. You know, it feels like you've been sacrificing yourself for something, you know, wasting time or holding on to a belief or holding on, hangman is hanging on to something um, that you need to let go of because change is needed, a new perspective is needed, a new life, a new life. I feel like you have a new life here. You are about to embark on a new journey, definitely with that Fool card and all these other cards. Um, you've been codependent. You've been in a toxic situation that you have been tied to uh, for all the wrong reasons. Maybe it was lust. Maybe it was codependency. Maybe it was sex. I don't know. Maybe it was materialism. I mean, that's behind you. Um, the devil is behind you. You've been living in some sort of hell, right? It's hell. Um, there's been delusion with that moon card reversed, pretending that everything is okay, but all is definitely not as, as it seems. And maybe you've been in denial. The Empress. She's smiling. She, she is. It's a very fertile time. It's a time of growth. It's a time of birth. It's a time of rebirth. It's a time of being loved and cared for, right? I mean, that's what the Empress does. Letting go of something. That's your advice. The hangman reverse, letting go. I mean, that is about letting go, okay? I feel like you've been struggling to let go of something, not learning, not learning a lesson. It's like fighting your inner self. 
missing an opportunity. You've been missing an opportunity. But the opportunity is still here because the page of pentacles is right above it. That's the opportunity. It's like it's, it's I don't know how long it's going to be there for though. So anyhow, uh, it's still there. It's still there. King of Swords is making a logical decision. You know, you have to be logical. You have to be wise. You have to use your intelligence. Use your brain, okay? Use your brain. But the overall outcome is the strength card reverse. That's weak. No courage, no confidence. <gasps> no confidence. It's right next to that fool. It's no confidence. You need to find your inner strength. You need to find your courage and your confidence and your willpower to let go. Let go of your fear. This is an opportunity for a new life. Act now. Think later. This is a dream. This is what you asked for. Pay attention to your dreams. Why are you letting fear get in the way? Why are you living in the darkness? Just go. Just do it. Step into that unknown territory. You're going to be given an opportunity. You probably already have. What are you waiting for? What are you waiting for? Are you too scared? Are you scared you're not going to be accepted? The Empress does everything with love. I feel like there's somebody waiting for you. Bird perked, waiting, waiting. Somebody's waiting. What is this strength card reverse? King of Cups. King of Cups, emotional. Emotional. It's very emotional. Listen to your heart. Listen to your heart. Follow your heart. Did we have that? Follow your heart. Listen to your heart. Yes, we did. Listen to your heart. Listen to your heart. You need to listen to your heart. These two cards make sense. Strength reverse and the King of Cups. Believe in yourself. Listen to your heart. Do what gives you joy. Come on. What are you waiting for? Just do it. Let go of your fear. You need to break free from something that you are tied to that is unhealthy. The hangman is about breaking free. The devil is tied. Tied to an unhealthy situation for codependent reasons. You need to find your inner strength to step into unknown territory. To climb that ladder to abundance. There's an opportunity for success. But there's so much fear. And you're dealing with somebody who is keeping you stuck. This person is full of illusion. They are. All is not as it seems. Definitely with that moon card reversed. There's also self-deception here. I think that you're, it's like you know. I feel like you know. I feel like you know that this isn't where you're supposed to be. You know that it's time to go. I feel like you know it, but you're ignoring it. You're ignoring it. You're ignoring the truth. You're ignoring it. You're living in this fantasy or you're living in this illusion or you're living in this darkness. Ignoring the truth. Why? Five of Pentacles. Five of pe Pentacles is financial burdens, right? It is. It's insecurity. Maybe you're insecure. Maybe you're staying where you're at because you're insecure. There may even be some poor health here. I feel like you're struggling. There's probably going to be a negative change or there's negative financial change with the Five of Pentacles. Really struggling with financial issues. I think that you need to make a choice. And we do have an ending in your future. Interesting. On the bottom of the deck, we have the emperor, which is taking charge, making a decision. 
Now we have the emperor and the empress. The emperor and the empress are a match made in heaven, right? They're a power couple. You need to you need to take action. Act now, think later. Take charge. Make a decision. Use logic. Use your head. But also follow your heart. Anyhow, I feel like this month you're going to be experiencing some sort of major disruption. It has been avoided up until now. The tower reverse is a permanent loss, moving something you never saw coming. Maybe somebody that you've been dealing with has been hiding something. Light is going to be shed. You're coming out of the darkness, okay? Definitely coming out of the darkness. Coming out of a dark period. You're about to embark on a new journey. This is a new life. This is exciting. Doing something spontaneous, spur of the moment, sudden change, extremely sudden change, climbing the ladder to success, endings that lead to new beginnings, a beautiful new life where you will be loved and cared for. Letting go, stepping into unknown territory is imminent. Letting go of fear, following the heart. What more can I say other than this is going to be a month of transformation for you? There's probably going to be an event that shakes up your life. That is the tower. Okay, that's a that's a made the very first card out. That is a major disruption. Okay, it's a major life change. It's a painful loss, but it's a necessary evil that can't be avoided because you are meant to be loved and cared for right you are meant to be true you are meant to have the best life you are meant to be abundant right you are meant to be loved you do have a new opportunity here that is also being presented to you from somebody this is a new project a new enterprise a new uh, doorway that is opening This person can, is giving you this opportunity because they see that you have some sort of skill. My stomach. Sorry, I haven't had nothing. Anyhow, um, it's going to be a major month of change. It is. We have an ending and we have a new life that begins right after. Good luck.